In today's video, we're going to be looking at the differences between the German Shepherd and the Vizsla. Both of these spectacular breeds have loyal followings and a keen intelligence for their work. Let's see how they compare head to head. Welcome back to the German Shepherd channel. If this is your first time here, my name's Charlie and I'm a certified canine leader here at FenrirCanineLeaders.com. This channel is dedicated to helping you learn everything you could possibly want to know about the German Shepherd. Then, how to become high level canine leaders that can raise the perfect German Shepherd. So if you're a lifelong lover, thinking about getting one or just started your journey with the new German Shepherd, then this is the channel for you. So, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to make sure you never miss a future journey. German Shepherd video. So let's dive into today's video and we'll take a deeper look at the main differences between these two amazing breeds. Let's dig right into each breed's history to get a better sense of how our cherished modern canines were developed. The German Shepherd dog was bred and developed in Germany, bred to protect farms and herds of sheep. They originally were not thought of as companions or brought into the house and stayed with the livestock all the time. That being said, they have excelled off the farm and in protection work for decades since the railways negated a large part of their job. The Vizsla is the modern version of the Magyar Empire that trampled through Europe in the 800s before settling in the region of Hungary. The Magyar people were known for their impressive cavalry and bred the same speed, agility and durability into their canines. The breed was refined over the following centuries by warlords and nobles alike, resulting in the sleek, gun dog we know today. The breed was nearly extinct after World War I, but was brought back from the brink by faciers, then brought to the US in the 1950s, where they've gained steady popularity ever since. Moving right along to their appearance, you'll notice that the two breeds look nothing alike. We see the biggest contrast between the breeds and their coats and grooming requirements, since the German Shepherd is known for its very long, dense, fluffy coat and undercoat. The German Shepherd will require brushing daily, and quite a bit of care in the grooming department compared to the Vizsla. They're also bigger and range from 75 to 95 pounds. And of course, the bigger the dog, the more fur they have to shed all over your house. The Vizsla is smaller, ranging from 45 to 60 pounds, and have a sleek coat that shows off their leath body. They shed seasonally, like most canines, but they have no undercoat, which reduces shedding greatly year round. That being said, they don't have any insulation since they don't have a double coat, so you may need to provide them with a coat or jacket if you live in colder regions. Their short coat can also make them prone to skin irritations, so it's important to check them for any rashes or bug bites. This brings us right into the trainability of each breed. The German Shepherd is highly intelligent and will make decisions for themselves without clear guidance from their leader. That being said, they are incredibly willing to please, but can be bored easily and become stubborn if not given the proper mental stimulation. The German Shepherd is very eager to please and intelligent, but will not become stubborn or willful out of boredom, so much as they will if they don't see you as their calm, consistent canine leader. The Vizsla is curious about everything and is as highly intelligent as they are energetic, so a poorly trained canine can be a handful. Luckily, they love treats and affection, so training them is quite easy for an experienced canine leader who can't easily be manipulated. They have a soft personality and do best with a calm, consistent leader who will set clear boundaries and not waffle about them. The Vizsla is a combination of a pointer and retriever, so they are excellent hunting companions, and those characteristics are part of what makes them so easy to train. Both are wonderful family dogs, though their temperaments and motivations are very different. German Shepherds are well known for police and military work they've done in both protection and scent detection, as well as being service dogs to those with disabilities. The German Shepherd is also good with all children, and once they've matured, they have a good sense of when they need to be gentle. The German Shepherd is very protective and known for its excellent guardian and protection instincts. The Vizsla is a wonderful family dog, but their guardian instincts are average, leading them to be more of a watch than a guard dog. 
As for being part of the family, visitors are exceptionally gentle and affectionate canines with children. They're typically very happy and friendly with strangers while maintaining close bonds with everyone in their immediate family. This is another breed that is Velcro to their people and will follow you from room to room without a fuss. Experienced canine leaders will find excellent guardians and family companions in both the German Shepherd and the Vizsla. Both dogs can thrive in active homes where they can get plenty of exercise and affection each day. Those looking for a top-notch home guardian will love the German Shepherd if their frequent shedding isn't an issue. Families looking for an active canine partner for agility or running will find the Vizsla a playful, enthusiastic canine, always up for an adventure. Before bringing either breed into your home though, consider your level of leadership and the time you'll be able to devote to these loyal breeds. I hope you've enjoyed today's video. If so, make sure you hit that like button and get involved down in the comments section below. And don't forget that if you're new here to make sure you subscribe. We have two dedicated German Shepherd videos coming here every week. So I can't wait to talk to you again on the next episode of the German Shepherd channel.